dust we two. Oh, that would be wonderful. Three, four, five. Oh, yes, Monsieur Marley. These are my children. Oh, how sweet. Didn't you chip your tooth from a jawbreaker one time? Who told you that? Yamamoto laughing. Lamal what? Lev couldn't eat ice cream for two weeks lol. Silence. Don't you know how sad that was for me? I can't even drink cold water. Imagine not being able to drink cold water. Couldn't be me. Kidney failure go bruh. Aliens. Bruh. Where the fuck did you come from? I was here the whole time. I'm actually craving for candy now. Just lick your screen lol. Excuse you? Oh, so they don't have skin. You think a rock would have flesh? But how is that even possible, though? The universe works in mysterious ways. That doesn't answer anything. Also, how come I don't get a white box in that video? Side character moment. You're a side character too. Uh, you too? I don't think volleyball exists in that world. Ots. You think they'd have time for ball games when they're fighting for their lives? You've got a point. Point. I just remember, back in middle school, I broke a friendship that wasn't mine. What? How? I don't even know. But it involved me asking a question. Huh? That's new. Mind sharing with the class? So there was this friend group of five to seven girls in my class at my last year of middle school. One day, I was alone at lunch. Because I'm lonely like that. Lol. And this girl from that group, let's call her Joey. She sat next to me for lunch. Ooh, shut up. I'm gay. She said her friends were nowhere to be seen. We began talking about school shit, but that was boring. So I asked her, you ever think about how your friends treat you? Sometimes? Oh, boy. And she starts talking about her friends. I just watched as she slowly realizes how toxic her friends were. Oh, after that, Joey started hanging out with me more. And less with her friends. I think that's a good thing. Of course, her friends noticed. So her friend came to her and asked, what's going on? Joey kept saying nothing every time they asked her. This went on for a few days. A few days? Yep. Eventually, Joey got annoyed and started yelling at them. There was a huge fight. Oh my god. A fight that went on for three days. Three days. And then boom. Friendship over. Joey still hung out with me after that till we graduated middle school. My goodness. Motoya. I don't know. I looked back and retraced as to how it all happened. And it went back to me asking Joey that question. So I kinda blame myself for starting that shit. On the bright side, you got her away from her toxic friends before anything else got worse. I tell myself that, but I can't help but feel bad. She still lost some friends. She would still lose them either way. You got her out of there, and that's what matters the most. Agreed. I wonder how she is now. I hope she got better friends. I love myself so much. Love myself so much. BTS would be proud. Diamonds are still breakable? Damn. Jojo lied to me. Stop just quoting BTS lyrics. I'm no longer upset at myself. I wanna punch other me so fucking bad right now. I'll join you. Are y'all forgetting other Iwazumis? A hardness of 10? Your hands will literally break before he does. Let's throw him in a wood chipper and see what happens. Hello? What? People do that with actual dead bodies sometimes. What the fuck? Did I get gaslit by everyone's stupidity? Can't you just play the next one now? It's 10 p.m. No. And nah. You're saying 10 p.m. as if you have a sleep schedule. And so what if I do? Whoa. Really? Unbelievable. No offense, but you're the last person I'd expect to have a sleep schedule. You have one too. Hypocrite. At least he makes sense. Bruh. Whatever. I'm snoozing. Y'all bullied him to sleep. He's a two, right? He won't be that hard to break. I'll ignore the fact that I'll die from mercury poisoning. Ken Manu Wu.
I was about to say, please. Stupidity. For some reason, I feel like our team's been chosen by the universe. If only you knew. What? Nothing. 